I was born in, in a town called Gweru in Zimbabwe. It's the third largest uh, city in Zimbabwe. I grew up on, um, on a farm. It was just one of these, you know, uh, struggle for survival yeah, in a country where we just uh, got independence. With the political developments in Zimbabwe from the year 2000 onwards, because of those uh, situations, you know, the political unrest and everything, the family had to to live. As a person on, on the run, I didn't bring much to Australia. I just brought uh, a small bag, you know, with a few possessions, just my uh, my ID and a few clothes. So I left uh, behind my wife, I left behind my, my parents, uh, brothers and sisters. But I had uh, two brothers uh, and a sister already here in Australia. That made my life a little bit easier, you know. They, they showed me around, you know, places of interest here in Wagga. Oh, I received my citizenship in March of 2010. The day that I received my um, uh, citizenship, yeah, it was one of those uh, uh, memorable days in my life, you know. And um, I was really happy that day, excited, you know, to, to be uh, part of Australia. Yeah, gotcha. Yep. So my, my job now is to, to assist the surveyor, you know, with uh, uh, collecting information you know, about features on the earth, you know. We go out, you know, to the farms, do subdivisions, uh, marking out boundaries, and like property boundaries. Uh, it's a hands-on training job, you know. I didn't have the qualifications before, but when I came here, they said, oh, what you, you need to know is, um, it's, it's all to do with measurements, you know. Uh, surviving is all to do with measurements. I joined here in 2009, April, Till now, I'm still here, 2011. Being a firefighter, uh, it is a challenging job, you know, because they, there's a lot of um, uh, incidents involved in there. It's, it's a passion for me. I don't have a problem. Wake up 3 o'clock in the morning, I go, I come back. I don't have a problem, so it's really good for me. It's very rewarding. I'm really proud to be part of that uh, uh, crew, you know, that sort of teaches Waga, you know, how important life is. <laughs>